With the debt ceiling default averted and Congress able to focus on something else like, say, confirming nominations, senior officials in President Obama's administration confirm he's chosen a new chief of Homeland Security. The president will announce that Jay Johnson is being nominated to the position at the White House today. Johnson was the Pentagon's top lawyer where he oversaw the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. If confirmed, Johnson would replace Janet Napolitano, who stepped down over the summer. At the time, Napolitano warned her successor would likely face an imminent threat to the nation's cybersecurity. Fox News speculates Johnson could face scrutiny from Obama's traditional supporters from the left. Because on his watch, the Obama White House not only embraced the Bush-era drone campaign, but dramatically expanded the targeting list to include American citizens. In recent years, Johnson helped lead the fight to end the don't ask, don't tell policy that barred gay men and lesbians from serving openly in the military. In 2011, though, Johnson suggested Martin Luther King Jr. would support the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. Afghanistan. He told a Pentagon group gathering to remember King, I believe that if Dr. King were alive today, he would recognize that we live in a complicated world and that our nation's military should not and cannot lay down its arms and leave the American people vulnerable to attack. If confirmed, Johnson would be the fourth Secretary of Homeland Security since President George W. Bush created the department after the 9-11 attacks. For Newsy, I'm Cliff Judy.